and welcome back to my channel if you're new here hello i'm Diana louise don't forget to leave a big thumbs up and don't forget to more importantly subscribe so today i'm all dressed up look at me with my makeup on which doesn't happen often on this channel we are going to watch wales which is my home country if you can't tell by the accent and you've never watched me before versus italy now me and jack did go to the france game last week and we lost very badly but it was expected but <laughs> we always very badly well, what I, I don't remember much. I quite drunk. Play, it was quite, uh, was it not? Quite brave, brave, hard. All right. Heart. I take it back. But anyway, so we um, enjoyed so much last week. We decided to book tickets for this week against Italy. Now, I would say like Italy, Wales always tend to beat Italy, don't they? So, yeah, hopefully we'll have a win today. But you know what, Wales can go both ways so we will see but we, i thought i'd take you along show the experience and yeah so let's go we're catching the train i'll show you my outfit now this is what i'm wearing i got rugby top make no the mess they were outfits i was gonna wear but i'm wearing this jack also has a rugby t-shirt on so well, yeah you you? yours so let's go oh, it's the train. Picking for Seco. Wish us luck. Just walk into the game. This stage is cool, isn't it? It is, it is an awesome stage. I will give Wales. We are gate two, so we are. What? Walking go... the wrong way. No, we're not. No, we're not. You can go over there, look. Next time we come here is for Ed Sheeran. Yeah, it is. Boop, boop, Ed. Day two. For some reason, the tickets are now on you. So that is. Last, we always pick the wrong kid. You can see the Cardiff Blue Stadium, which is cool, can't help. Yeah. One stadium, two.
I actually left Jack like five minutes before and we were winning and then when I left we are now losing and we have lost. Um, so Wales lost, lovely, I'm a bit drunk and online. But I'm just coming to ask Connors, because reservation was going to be up and they want to charge us. So I like run from the end of the game because I timed it wrong. So yeah, we're going to have some food and some cocktails and carry on our evening. Yummy! Oh. what it's resorted to. So we went to Agnes at a wicked time, weren't we? We were partying, dancing, thank you to at least we've never been there and never go there again. We be, were in there about 45 minutes and we had zero drinks because the bar was so full. Also, if you go with your boyfriend, I wouldn't recommend because there's all the really hot girls dancing on the bar. No, to be fair, they were really pretty, but like, there was just loads of them and it was just busy. They were so slow in there, I just wouldn't recommend. So we've just how do you buy them? So we decided to get some drinks, go on the train and we're gonna go to a pub or somewhere closer to home because it is so busy down here. So that is the plan. So um yeah, you last time you seen us we were walking on the streets of Cardiff and Jack was carrying four cans of strongbow. Um, basically, by the time we got to the train, there was this whole, like, massive delay with the trains because something had happened, um, so we were waiting for ages for that. By the time we got on the train, I'm not lying to you, we were all, we, we were all, we were both shattered, and we'd, like, sobered up so much that we were just tired, so we were like, do you know what, let's just go home, like, we were gonna go to a club by, at, like, get off on the train and go to a club, then we were going to go to the pub, literally right by our house. And I think we got like two stops into the train and we were like, yeah, we're tired. Like, it coyote ugly killed us. Honestly, if you're looking for somewhere to go in Cardiff, I would not rec... I recommend most places, but I wouldn't recommend coyote ugly. Unless you're going to book like a table and like a booth where you got your drinks there. It's not worth it, is it? Jack is here, but he's over there and he's in his pants. So I'm, I'm not going to show him. But yeah, we were literally at the bar for what, 45 minutes? Yes. That was me nodding, yeah. <laughs> camera, yeah. Um, we were in there for 45 minutes queuing. So you can imagine, like, that sobered us up quite a lot because we didn't drink and it was quite hot in there as well. So it was like as if the drink, like, sweated out to us. So by the time we got outside then, we were a bit like, hmm. We were still tipsy, but we weren't like, do you get that point when you're drunk when you're like, tired but you like carry on and you get drunk and then you're having a good time we got to that point where it was like in the middle do you know what i mean <laughs> stop mocking me he's copying me behind the camera um but yeah so we like was we kind of drunk ourselves sober type of thing like we were just had enough so we ended up coming home um i would say we were both quite i felt sick on the train as well didn't i I don't know why. I think I suffer with travel sickness because it's not the first time it's happened. And I felt so sick and I didn't know if it was the drink or whatever. So I literally come home. I had a bucket by the bed. I wasn't sick. Um, we ordered pizza. I didn't even eat it. And I think, and we watched the Eddie Hall and Thor fight. Um, and then we went to sleep after that. So we were sleeping by like half ten. Like we were literally in bed flat out. And then Jack woke up in the middle of the night and thought he was going to be sick. So we did have quite a lot to drink, but we weren't really hungover, I wouldn't say. A bit groggy, like. And then our washing machine broke on Sunday, so it was just, it was just, you know, great. And Wales obviously lost to Italy. If you didn't know, it was Italy's first win in... Seven years in Six Nations. Seven years in the Six Nations, and first win at Wales. Yeah, so um, mm. we went to two out of three... Home games and they lost the two that we went the to. One we didn't go to they won. Yeah, and the one we didn't go to was the only game they won. <laughs> were you bad luck? You were bad luck. <laughs> oh yeah. But yeah, so and then what was really sweet though, one of the players gave um Jonathan Davis, was it? No. What was his name? I can't remember. Oh my god, people are gonna wait me. Johnny Ad John Adams. Josh Adams. <laughs> I know what he looks like. Josh um, give it to number 15, Italy, was it? Yeah. Because he played really well and they give him man of the match, but he gave it to him, which was re a really sweet gesture. 
But um, it is now Monday evening. I've just edited the vlog and it's it's not too long, but I think it's still worth uploading. So I hope you all enjoyed watching it. Um, and if you want to see me take you along to more of these things, because I do love what, like, go into these things. Like, we do quite a lot like that, don't we? Like, sports wise, because Jack's, like, loves sports, even though he doesn't play it. What'd you do that for? Because <laughs> you, you, he's a plastic fan, really. You, mean, can, you can still like sports. Not you are really. a plastic fan, though. Plastic fan what? <laughs> Within war, though. Football. How? Cardiff City. How, How often passes? do you go and watch them? Um... Every time they're on. Every time they're on. Every time they're on. I'm free hours go. We'll leave it there because I'm right. No, no, I'm not having this. I'm not having this. It's all like. No, no, I'm not having this. <laughs> well, you can do it. So that's early hearing me. No, no, I'm not having this. I'm not having this. <laughs> plastic fan, plastic fan, plastic fan. If I could show you his face right now, I would, but he's obviously. <laughs> so, yeah, anyway. So, I'm going to stop jibbering and jabbing because I've spoken there for five minutes now. So, I will catch you in the next video very soon. And the next video to go up is actually a really, really, really exciting video. So, I hope you're all looking forward to it and make sure to check it out. And that video will be with you on Thursday. So, I'll catch you on Thursday. Bye, guys.